Hello, truth seekers, and welcome back to our channel, where we unveil the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Ladies and gentlemen, gather round for a shocking revelation that will leave you questioning the true intentions of the infamous duo, Meghan and Harry. I've just stumbled upon a bombshell that exposes the depths of their cunning plot against the royal family. Brace yourselves, because furious Tom Bauer has uncovered evidence that Meghan Markle copyrighted the name Lilibet before even giving birth to her daughter. Can you believe it? How dare she? But before we move on to any further details, I would love to thank you all for your enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for, guys? Hit that subscribe button now and don't forget to press that bell icon. Perfect. So let's get started. So now, before you dismiss this as a mere gossip, let's delve into the details. According to a royal expert, Meghan allegedly took out the copyright for the name Lilibet well before the arrival of her daughter. This revelation adds a whole new layer to the late Queen Elizabeth's fury. As it appears, Meghan was not only playing a victim but also scheming behind the scenes. Let's take a moment to reflect on the significance of the name Lilibet. It was a term of endearment used by the late monarch herself when she was just a toddler struggling to pronounce her own name. King George V, her grandfather affectionately called her Lilibet, mimicking her attempts to say Elizabeth. This name held a deeply personal intimate connection to the Queen's childhood and family. Now, enter Meghan and Harry, who, according to reports, claimed the Queen had given them her blessing to use the name Lilibet for their daughter. However, the late Queen Elizabeth was allegedly furious about this announcement, and it's not hard to see why. Royal biographer Tom Bauer has condemned Meghan and Harry's actions as appalling. In an interview with GB News, Bauer revealed that Meghan had officially copyrighted the name even before Lilibet's birth. This move, as Bauer points out, allows Meghan to use the names for various purposes, perhaps even commercial gain. Imagine the late queen's distress upon realizing that the name, so intimately tied to her own history, was being exploited for personal gain. But it doesn't end there. The disrespect doesn't stop at the copyright office. Meghan Markle, the spotlight-hungry individual that she is, allegedly sought revenge against the royal family for not treating her as she believed she deserved. Remember the over-the-top curtsy imitation during the Netflix broadcast? A move that one can only interpret as a deliberate attempt to mock and disrespect the Queen. What's truly disheartening is that Prince Harry, who once expressed deep admiration for the Queen, seems to have been caught in the crossfire of Meghan's vendetta. The biographer notes that Harry would have stayed longer in the royal family, in part because of his admiration for the Queen, yet Meghan's actions and apparent disregard for Harry's feelings have left him stricken. This revelation is not just about a name, it's about a calculated and disrespectful move that tarnishes the memory of a beloved monarch. The late Queen Elizabeth expressed her dismay, reportedly saying, I don't own the palaces, or the paintings, only my name. And now they've taken that. Meghan and Harry's attempt to capitalize on the royal name for personal gain is not just appalling. It's a betrayal of the trust bestowed upon them. As we await responses from Buckingham Palace and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, it's crucial to question the true motives behind these actions. Is Meghan's desire for the spotlight so insatiable that she's willing to exploit even the most sacred aspects of the royal legacy? And what does this mean for Prince Harry, caught in the web of his wife's revenge? In the court of public opinion, the evidence is damning. Meghan and Harry's actions deserve scrutiny, and it's time for the public to demand accountability. How dare they trample on the legacy of a beloved queen for their own selfish gains? The shocking truth must be exposed, and the repercussions for this audacious act should be swift and severe. So what are your thoughts on this explosive revelation? Drop your opinions in the comments below and let's keep the conversation going. Until then, stay tuned for more shocking stories and scandalous exposés on our YouTube channel. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on the latest from the world of the royal family. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Bye for now.